Today I'm going to show you how to get Cosmog, Poipol and Spiritomb. As we're closing in on the end of our Crown Tundra coverage, we've got three Pokemon that we're going to discuss and show you how to get today. These are all gift Pokemon that you can obtain in the Crown Tundra and we're going to be kicking it off with Cosmog. So the things that you need to do before you're able to obtain Cosmog is encounter either Glastria or Spectria in the Freezington village. It will be attacking the village and it will have an interaction with you where you do battle it. Now after this battle, you can approach this house in Freezington and there'll be a little Cosmog sitting in the corner. Now when you you approach it you interact with it and the NPC character here will thank you for saving the village and then offer you Cosmog as a very skilled trainer and she feels like you're more than capable of taking care of it and raising it as one of your own so that is how you get Cosmog in the game and then we'll move on to a little bit of a more taxing Pokemon to obtain but that is Poipol and obviously then it's evolution Naganadel it is an ultra beast and to obtain it you are gonna need to have a few things come complete before you're able to do this. When you first enter the Crown Tundra, as you all know, Peony will give you three legendary clues. These are for catching Calyrex, the legendary birds, and the Regis. Now, once you've complete these, feels like the game's finished, but as we've already covered on previous videos, you do come back to the house and there is a shiny object which turns into a note which is depicting uh, the ultra wormholes. Now when you visit Peony, he will say that the note's not his, but then he will create a new legendary clue for you, which is to obtain the ultra beast in the Dynamax Adventures. What you need to do to get Poipol is to catch five Ultra Beasts from the Dynamax Adventures. And there are a lot of misconceptions about obtaining Poipol. There are people saying you only need to complete 15 Dynamax battles, and I can guarantee you that that is not the case. If you wanna have a look at my current Dynite or Stash, I've completed a lot more than 15 Dynamax Adventures. So it is 100% not 15 Dynamax Adventure runs. 100% do not waste your time doing that this is the only way that Poipol has appeared for me and Necrozma was literally the first Ultra Beast I caught I caught a subsequent four Ultra Beasts after this which would take you to five and Poipol didn't appear and it wasn't until I had that stack attacker encounter captured stack attacker that took me to five Ultra Beasts when Poipol appeared so just be aware that there is some information out there that is not correct and it is five Ultra Beasts that you need to catch to have Poipol spawn in the max lair and this can be quite a grind because it's taken me a long time well over a day of actually going through the Dynamax adventures to get five Ultra Beasts and because we have such an array of legendaries to catch getting those Ultra Beasts can be quite a task. Now, once you have got the fifth one though, once you exit that Dynamax adventure, as you can see, Poipol will now appear in the Max Lair. Uh, you can then approach it, but be aware that it is shiny locked. So there is no point of soft resetting for it in this instance. You will not be able to get it as a shiny, unfortunately, in Sword and Shield. Now, as you approach it, it does speak, and then the NPC character does state, I believe that Pokemon is known as Popoil. I found it a little while ago deep within the Max Lair, but the more I study it, the more questions I have. It's such a strange Pokemon. I believe it might have something to do with the current situation. I really need to buckle down and focus my research of the Max Lair. But Popoil keeps trying to wander off as soon as I take my eyes off it. I'd like a skilled trainer to accept Popoil and take care of it for me. Would you happen to be interested, Osiris? So I say yes, of course, and that is is it you get Poipol there and like I say it is a little bit taxing getting the actual five Ultra Beasts uh, in the Max Lair you've got to catch the five Ultra Beasts within the Dynamax Adventures um, to unlock this event and uh, like I say it took me a long time to bump into them you can speak to Peonia who is in the Max Lair as well. She may give you some routes to Zerkatry, Celesteela, or some of the other Ultra Beasts that will speed it up for you. But uh, the randomness of the uh, Dynamax Adventures is pretty grueling at times. But it is nice to be able to finally get Poipol. And you can also evolve it into Naganadel. All you would need to do is head to a Pokemon Center, teach it Dragon Pulse. It is a relearnable move, and it does relearn it at 20. So you can teach it that, and then level it up once, and it will turn into Naganadel. 
Ganadel. So moving on to our final Pokemon gift Pokemon or special encounter Pokemon of this episode, we're going to look at how to get Spiritomb. Now Spiritomb is a Pokemon available in the Crown Tundra. It is something you will need to catch to complete your Crown Tundra Pokedex. So this is probably quite an important little method for us to look at. So the first thing you want to be doing is traveling down to Dynatree Hill. Now in this area, you will be able to take a route to your right and then down a slope and in a little corner there will be a gravestone there now if you read the gravestone it will read words are carved into this ancient tombstone spread my voice and that's it that's all it will give you so what you need to do from this point is actually hook up to the internet and what you're going to have to do is speak to 32 other pokemon trainers now it doesn't take too long pokemon trainers are popping up everywhere and you can just approach them speak to them but just keep a count because it is 32 trainers in total that you will need to speak to there are some misconceptions about the amount of trainers that you will need to speak to but i have done this twice unfortunately in my first recording the video footage that i had was corrupt so i couldn't use that i've had to come over to my shield copy and do this method all over again but it just confirms that you only need to speak to 32 trainers to actually get spiritomb and once you've spoken to those 32 trainers you can then approach the tombstone once again and this time the tombstone will read my voice has been heard now when that text appears you know that the criteria for this spawning pokemon spiritomb has been complete what you want to do at this point is just take a few steps back from the tombstone and then set up camp and exit camp straight away and when you do exit camp you will see a spiritomb there and you can just approach it and capture it but do bear in mind that spiritomb is not shiny locked so you will be able to hunt this spiritomb shiny you can stave in front of it and then just soft reset for this one if you would like to catch it as a shiny pokemon and good luck with that so that wraps up this episode. They are the three Pokemon that we're covering in today's episode. I'm showing you how to get Cosmog, the Poipol, and Spiritomb. These are three really nice Pokemon that we've got access to in the Crown Tundra. I hope you found this guide useful and it's made getting these Pokemon for yourselves a lot easier. If you've enjoyed the episode, make sure to drop a like. It only takes two seconds and it would really, really mean something and I would really appreciate it. If you are new to the channel and you found this useful and you would like to see more content like this, and other Pokemon content and gaming content that we do here on the channel do consider hitting that subscribe button and leave your comments down below let me know what one of these three Pokemon is your favorite one that you've got is it Poipol, Cosmog or is it that Spiritomb I gotta say Poipol I got a really soft spot for Naganadel I do love it as an Ultra Beast but I'm gonna wrap it up there thank you so much for tuning in have a great rest of your day and I'll catch you all for another episode very soon so until then take care bye bye